Hi guys, welcome again. Uh, this time coming to you with another uh, replay analysis of my own game. Uh, this was a pretty fun one. Uh, there were. Uh, this was very unusual, I would say. I, I, this is the first time I, I played like this. Uh, but it is kind of interesting, so I think I, I thought I will show you this one. Uh, so here, four player game, I'm climbing back again. Uh, it's not that easy. <laughs> Because the higher I get, the, the more punishing the losses are, and the less rewarding the, the wins are. Uh, but, you know, decently rated game. I'm picking B, of course, as B is uh, much better for Halicarnassus. And here, let's think about uh, the first hand and the setup, as you should always do. Uh, here, uh, I'm sitting next to Colossus, so uh, going for red. Is kind of suicidal. You you can do it, but I wouldn't expect a, a result better than the second place, probably. Uh, so naturally, with Halicarnassus, the easy choice is green, but it's not ideal here, as two green cards are on this hand, and they are the one offs. Of, one offs. Uh, the mm, the tablet is uh, is doubled. Like there are two cards with tablet. In four-player games, uh, these are only singles, so I need both of them. Uh, but as there is no alternative, there is no double resource, no nothing, uh, I'm still going for it, for this. Um, if this wasn't uh, double singles, <laughs> uh, I would go for press or uh, glassworks, actually, just to, to set up something and maybe pivot from, from there. But here, uh, Apothecary is the choice for me. Okay, uh, so here I get my double resource and I get Scriptorium and I opt for, for the Clay Pit. Um, it's just so nice for my wonder. Uh, also, it lets me get fights. Maybe I can win the fight with this guy in the first era. Uh, yeah, so first I was like, let's grab this, but then I was like, no, 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 go back. Mm, here are a couple of interesting choices. This lets me uh, build a wonder with with the help of this. So this is a possibility. This and this, they are both a possibility. Uh, I prefer Pawn Shop, uh, just so this one pawn higher. And I hope to not have time to build uh, blue cards in the second era. Guard Tower is also a possibility. I can go for Heavy Red uh, now. Uh, I can go for Heavy Red because I got Clay Pit, so I can build Guard Tower and the fight. Uh, and uh, also I have Apothecary, which will uh, let me build three stables, so I can actually go for it. But here I went for like a safe choice, I would say, so I'm just going for Pawn Shop. I don't know these guys like stance on, on red, so I, I didn't want to to fight with, with them, and as you can see, there is Barracks coming, which I knew was coming, because I knew uh, the previous hands. Uh, here, another couple of possibilities. Uh, I can go Barracks, um, just to win with this guy. He probably won't uh, build anything. If the fight is coming, then this guy will build it. I can go for East Trading, for Colossus, uh, very nice. Uh, I can go for Orvain, just to have this secured. Uh, Stone Pit, uh, I would stay away for, from this, but this is not like a bad pick or something, this is playable. Uh, here I'm going for Barracks, uh, just because yeah, this Colossus is kind of like not doing that much red. But I like that pick, that last pick, I can see all of these picks being good. Uh, here uh, there is press, which I'm picking, uh, just because I know that the second scriptorium is coming back. Uh, there is also altar, which is not terrible. Uh, it lets me do maybe something with blues. Uh, marketplace, I would stay away probably. Uh, but it has its benefits. Uh, if I pick marketplace, I can get caravanserai for free. Uh, so actually, like. All of these are, are okay. I, I just wanted a heavier splash in, in green, just because I'm before this guy in the next uh, in the next round, so that uh, that is a benefit, of course. Uh, 
And here, um, yeah, again, I can win fight with this guy, but it's not worth it, I think. Scriptarium is, is just better. Okay, and coming to the second era, my plan is just to build as much red as possible. Mm, I have access to everything. Uh, the school costs me two gold, and the, mm, the second stage cog costs me two gold as well. So probably I will just build one, not the other. Uh, another thing that I need to do is to build uh, double clay, so I have access to this. Unfortunately, my money is pretty weak. So, we'll see how it goes. Uh, first, uh, library. Excellent card, it gets me Senate for free, so uh, pretty good. Uh, because of how heavy this guy went into green, I do not expect to get free, free sets. Uh, that would be kind of delusional, I think, uh, at this point. Uh, so my plan is to get just two sets, so library sets me up. Uh, then I need... Um, I need I will probably build uh, the second stage apothecary, which is dispensary, uh, just because there are two of them. Uh, so the one card that I want to build is actually the, the cog one, but they know this, they should know this, and they can block me. He builds cool, so yeah, three sets is kind of gone at this point. Uh, so here, uh, this is kind of tricky because I know that this can come back to me. Uh, like they won't bury this for, for like the doubles, but on the other hand, they can kind of. <laughs> uh, I don't know if that makes sense. I would want to build a quarry, but I need to have two gold so I can build the other one. Uh, so here I'm just going for dispensary because there is nothing better. Uh, but if there were like a fight, like a stables here, I, I would build it. And unfortunately, this guy is going for red, as he should. And here is here is another very tricky choice. There is stables, which is okay, but but not that great. There is card house, which is again nice, but not that great. And there is brickyard, which I want to build, and I can build it because then I have the resources to build a laboratory. So this is actually a gold I can spend, and that's what I went for. Um, I think I think it's correct, but I'm not one hundred percent sure. Uh, the other choice for me is to pick uh, like one of these, and then uh, build this, and from this build brickyard from the graveyard. That would be a possibility also. Here, uh, another tricky choice. I'm building either one of these or throwing uh, this away, I guess. So, uh, I ended up bu building the foundry just so I can build this stage, uh, but that leaves me with no wood and no stone, which I thought would be suicidal. I thought like, okay, I guess I'm losing this game. Uh, it happens, but yeah, you will see what happens. Okay, and there is one problem with my build. Uh, I don't have battle. So, this is a lifesaver. I need this. And this is uh, card number one, two, three, four, five. So, this is still fine. And here, none of. I have both of these already built, so I'm just building from the discard. But there in the discard, um, there is maybe slight, um, like, there is soul mill, and there is card house. Maybe there is guard tower, but guard tower just give me one point, so not that amazing. And I ended up going for card house, I think. Uh, I don't know if that was correct, to be honest. I think that the soul mill might be better. Uh, 
Whether I just got six sparks from my first stage wonder. How cool is that? Okay, here um, I'm just going for two sets, right? And this is like the worst hand that I can possibly see. Uh, I know that this guy won't get that that many cocks from me. Like he's probably going for two sets as well, so he needs just one. And we are fighting for it. So I thought that I need like one of these will come back to me. Uh, he can't bury, he can't bury, he can just bury one, but he will leave this for the last card. He won't uh, risk it, so he can bury, especially after uh, he's just after me. Uh, so uh, here I'm actually picking Pantheon just to to make this hand terrible for for everyone else except maybe this guy, and I know that something good is coming back for from this hand uh, to me. So that, that that's actually pretty nice because I know that the hand before the last one, which is uh, the hand that as Halicarnassus, I really don't want to be, I really don't want this hand to be bad. So I'm actually getting Pantheon here. And I hope to get Observatory back when, when, when this comes back. Okay, here, uh, as I said, I'm, I'm not going into full green. Like, this is just five points. Uh, this is kind of worth bearing against this guy. This is worth eight to him right now. And could be even more, but I can't. Like, the, I cannot build this, this stage right now. Uh, so I'm just capitalizing on this and, and getting uh, the guild for, for yellows. And they went heavy into red. So red is out of the question for me right now. Uh, okay, so here I can build gardens, which it will give me five points, or I can build uh, this one, which will give me four now, but probably five or six. Uh, and I don't want to pass this guild to him. Uh, I'd rather he, he just build this. So, so here, just philosopher. He will probably build this anyway, but... Just building green guild here. And thankfully this guy built this one, so this is worth <coughs> seven. Here this is really tricky, and uh, I really fought for a long time here. And I think I made the correct choice. I'm building palace here. And you may ask, why not, like, palace is eight, right? This will be eight right now. But this makes the, uh, the the next card 10, because that, that would give me two full sets. Uh, at this moment, I am, I'm not sure I will complete this. But then I thought, okay, I will just take Palace. I'll take the cock from the next, next one, and then I build my Wonder, and I get this Scientific Guild. Because he won't bury Scientific Guild, and he won't build Scientific Guild. Like, um, when I, I build this, this guy is 100% getting Town Hall. Uh, I'm I'm sure he, he he's building town hall, and then the last hand comes to him, and he has this uh, chamber of commerce and scientific guild, and he was he will build chamber of commerce because it gives him more points. Uh, so that means scientific guild is in the discard, and I can safely build it. As you can see, I almost made this mistake, but then I was like, no, 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 go back. Here, Observatory came back to me, uh, which is expected because study was uh, free for him from school. Uh, he's building even more fights. And uh, here I'm just burying uh, Haven because Haven gives me four and University gives me five. But I'm 100% sure, maybe, maybe like 99, uh, that, uh, that the guild will come, come back. Uh, he he built the, the town hall as I predicted, of course. This was not a hard prediction by any means. And here, scientific guild. I'm finishing this. Uh, really nice resources. I have five cards uh, just to build all stages of my wonder. Uh, pretty good. Uh, Pretty good green splash, uh, guilds that are good but not like by, by any chance overpowered, this is 7 points, and good blue cards. Uh, I'm really happy how, how I played this game, and hopefully you guys enjoy it. Uh, see you later, bye!